I believe for every drop of rain that falls A flower grows I believe that somewhere in the darkest night A candle glows I believe for everyone who goes astray Someone will come to show the way I believe, I believe I believe above a storm The smallest prayer can still be heard I believe that someone in the great somewhere hears every word. Every time I hear a newborn baby cry or touch a leaf or see the sky, then I Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Elvis Presley's favorite gospel songs. I'm your host, Graham Patrick, and I'm so happy to be here with you guys tonight. And thank you for being with us. We hope you will enjoy yourselves. I would like to take you back now to a show that we did in December of 2019. This was one of the last times I had this opportunity to sing with the fabulous Stamps Quartet. And it's my pleasure to introduce them to you right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Ed Enoch and the Stamps Quartet. Your tree. 
Ja, guten Abend, herzlich willkommen hier im Israel Festival Center zu unserer Gospel, ja Show kann man eigentlich nicht sagen, zu unserem Gospel Konzert und äh, viele Leute haben mich gefragt, woher kommt das Wort Gospel? Es ist eigentlich eine Abkürzung, einmal aus dem Wort Gott, God vom Englischen, Gott und Spell, Spelling heißt Buchstabieren, das heißt es geht beim Gospel um das Evangelium, die ganzen Texte kommen aus der Bibel. Im Mittelpunkt bei diesen ganzen Liedern steht dann auch immer Jesus ganz alleine. Er ist das zentrale Thema, um das die ganzen Lieder gehen. Und er ist es auch, der Elvis Herz höher schlagen ließ. Heute, sagt man, gerockt hat. Wir haben früher, die Älteren sagen, was einen bewegt hat. Vielleicht gelingt es uns auch, Sie heute etwas zu bewegen. Auf die Frage, woher woher er sein Talent hat, antwortete Elvis immer von Gott. God gave me this voice. Und er hat sich auch öfters die Frage gestellt, habe ich als Christ versagt? Die deutsche Presse hingegen machte sich immer lustig über Elvis und deshalb haben wir eigentlich in Deutschland einen vollkommen falschen Eindruck, was für ein Mensch Elvis war. Sie bezeichneten ihn im Fernsehen als Hüftwackel-Champion, als das Becken modischer Feiztanz, aber die Krönung war natürlich Spiegelmagazin, amerikanischer Schreier, aber sehr zur US-Reklamefigur. Auf dem Höhepunkt seiner Karriere 71 verpflichtete er dann bis zu seinem Tod das Stamps Quartett aus Nashville. Das sind die vier Herren. Am Bass Michael Means. Bariton Joe Combs, Tenor Bobby Davenport, das Ganze unter der Leitung des legendären Leadsängers des Stamps Quartets, der damals wirklich mit dabei war als junger Mann, er sieht heute auch noch jung aus, hält sich gut, wir halten ihn jung hier bei den Konzerten, Ed Enoch. Und das nächste Lied, das sie singen, war das allerletzte Lied, das sie gemeinsam mit Elvis Presley gesungen haben. In His Hands. Jesus changed my life completely. Praise His name. Show the way to heaven. Praise his name, praise his name. I will follow him always. If I try, now stop and pray. For I told that he. to know I'm not alone, or I can't face life on my own. Yes, my life has been much sweeter since he came. Since he Rest 
forever in His hand. In His hand. Ed, Elvis hatte ich immer vorgestellt, bei allen Konzerten wurde er vorgestellt. Ladies and Gentlemen, please make welcome my dear friend Ed Enoch, the best and most powerful lead vocalist in the world. Ja. Und, und das ist er auch bis heute, er ist ein guter Freund, er ist seit... You're coming here since 13 years, I think. The first time we did something like that was 13 years ago, 2006. Oh, only seemed like yesterday, doesn't it? What did gospel for Elvis mean? What did gospel mean for Elvis? Well, Elvis loved gospel music, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I guess more than any music there was. Whenever he was around Elvis at his home or in a studio with him or, or wherever he might be, he'd be talking about gospel music, listening to gospel music. Uh, I think, without a doubt, he wanted to sing that more than anything in the world. And uh, his love for it brought us to every night before we go on stage, we would begin to, uh, he wanted to hear a gospel song before we went on stage every night, wherever we were. And we did a song, Bernhard called Sweet Sweet yeah, Spirit. Yeah. And that was his favorite song, and that was something that we did. Uh, I can't tell you how many thousand times we've sung that song. But Lord, I wish I had an opportunity to do that again for him. Also Elvis war total begeistert von Gospel. Er wollte immer Gospel singen. Er hatte auch mal vorgesungen bei verschiedenen Gospelchören. Die haben ihn nicht aufgenommen, weil sie dachten, der singt doch nicht so ganz gut. Und äh, ja, es war einfach seine Leidenschaft. Und vor jedem Konzert hat er sich getroffen mit den Stamps. Die mussten zu ihm in Dressing Room und da haben die miteinander eine Stunde, bevor er überhaupt rausging, Gospellieder gesungen. Oder auch nach Konzerten haben sie Gospellieder gesungen. Und es gab ein ganz besonderes Lied, was er immer hören wollte, bevor er auf die Bühne geht. There was a very special song. Und das war, became your signature song. Yes. Und das war das Lied Sweet, Sweet Spirit. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, if you would, I would like to ask the Stamps if they would sing a song that they do by themselves. It's a beautiful song called Sweet, Sweet Spirit. And I don't sing in this. Just listen to them, please. There's a sweet, sweet spirit in this place.
Ladies and gentlemen, that was the Stamps Quartet. Michael Means on bass, Joe Combs on baritone, and Bobby Davenport on tenor. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, the lead singer, what Elvis would used to say about this gentleman, he would always announce him as one of the strongest voices in gospel music, and that, of course, is Mr. Ed Enoch. And it just so happens, ladies and gentlemen, that I had this opportunity to talk with Ed just recently, and I had a few questions for him. So I hope you enjoyed. Here's my interview with Ed Enoch. Ed, Mr. Ed Enoch, we are on. Thank you hello, so much my for being here. I, hello, my friend. I love you so much, Ed. Thank you for taking this time to, uh, to chat with us. I mean, I, well, first of all, I mean, I, I wanted to talk uh, about, did, did, you have a, did you have a certain preference, uh, like a, a style of music that you liked? I mean, like, how did gospel. you get into gospel? Well, I mean, it was, it, it, I think that was a, a lot of people uh, in that area, right? I mean, this is the way that people grew up in, yeah. in, in the Southern states. Yeah, that's all we saying, you know, when I was a kid, uh, you know, go to church and you know you sing at yeah. church and, and and it was uh, and 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 back then when I was a kid, uh, you know, three or four churches would come together. It might be Baptist, might be Methodist, it might be you know Presbyterian, or some you know religion, some factor, but they all worshipped together, and they all sung those beautiful hymns. You know, I, when I yeah. think about hymns, I want to cry. They lived it. That's the foundation of gospel yeah. music. A lot of people just pass it over because they don't think it's cool. Yeah, no, but I it is some of the cool. Most, it's it's it's, the, it's some of the most soulful stuff. I mean, that's, it's cool, brother. And I'm telling you yeah, something. Yeah. It will deal with you uh, when you're lonely, when you're sick, when you feel like you don't have a friend. Yeah, it will talk to you. Yeah. It's just like it's just a, it's just this 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 area that just uh, grew all these amazing singers and well, I mean, to so. look at the gospel uh, imprint upon Elvis's life. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I mean, he did the same thing. He he sang at church, and he, you know, he he uh, he went to the Seminoles of God Church there in, in Memphis, and he sang there. He he had that uh, was born in him. Yeah. Yeah. Along with rhythm and blues, and and you know he loved black music. You know he loved that feel. Yeah. So, but they but they came out of the church. See, yeah, that that came out of gospel. Isn't that kind of crazy? Yeah. Isn't it? yeah, it's just a well. It's a, yeah. It's like the foundation, really, isn't it? Uh, I mean, that's yeah. where I, I guess rhythm and blues would come from a place of faith as well. You know. Well, sure. I, yeah. I've always thought that. Because you're telling a life story. You yeah. know, some are sad, yeah. some are happy, but the music always kind of turns you to a point of enjoyment. When I think of how he came so far from glory Came to dwell among the lowly such as I To suffer shame and such disgrace On Mount Calvary take my place Then I ask myself this question who am I who am I that a king would bleed and die for who am I that he would pray not mine but thy Lord The answer I may never know Why he ever loved me so That to an old rugged cross he'd go For who am I? When I'm reminded of his words I'll leave you never 
If you'll be true, I'll give to you life forever. Oh, I wonder what I could have done to deserve God's only son to fight my battles until they're won. For who am I? Who am I that a king would bleed and die for? Who am I that he would pray, not mine but thy Lord? The answer I may never know why he ever loved me so but to an old rugged cross he'd go for who am i oh to an old rugged cross he'd go for who am i I think just singing with these guys, singing with the Stamps Quartet, with Ed Enoch and the Stamps, that any moment we get to do that is my favorite. Tonight we're going to show this uh, performance, which uh, I believe was uh, probably our last performance. I believe it was 2019. This was my last chance to perform with them, and I hope that someday soon we get to perform again. Ed, then we only need someone who can sing Elvis, right? The only yes, thing sir. is we need somebody who can sing like Elvis. Oh, I know who it is, Bernhard. Yeah? There's only one. Only one. And we got him here. Right here. Mr. Graham Patrick Dahl. Yeah, yeah Dublin geboren, Toronto aufgewachsen, in Las Vegas wurde er dann entdeckt und uh, seit 2003 gehört er zur festen Besetzung von Stars in Concert. Diesen Saal bezeichnet er immer als sein Wohnzimmer und er wird hier so lange spielen, bis wir ihn auf der Trage abtragen. Ich hoffe, das dauert noch 30 Jahre. Please welcome Graham Patrick. Living below in the soul sinful world Hardly a comfort can afford Striving along to face temptation sword oh, Won't you tell me where could I go but to the You tell me where could I go but to the Lord? Life here is grand with the friends I love so dear. Hardly a comfort can afford. Yeah. Death. Well, won't you tell me where could I go but to the Needing a friend, a friend. 
will save me save in the end. Me. But won't you tell me where could I go but to the
being an Elvis fan. Ever since I was a kid, I mean, obviously, I mean, I loved Elvis and his music and uh, just his persona, the way he looked. He was just a very different guy. And uh, so I fell in love initially with his, with his music. Uh, and then as I, obviously, as the, the, the more of a fan I became, well, then I realized he, he was really uh, deeply religious and he loved uh, gospel music. That, that was really, that was his passion. Gospel music was Elvis Presley's passion. Yeah, so I would listen to this music, and uh, I, I guess in the beginning, it really, it took me a while. To hear his sincerity of the way he sang it drew me in. It, was, it just brought me into this gospel music, and uh, subsequently, it's uh, become uh, my favorite music out of all that he has done. So, uh, yeah, gospel music, I'm a huge fan of Elvis Presley's gospel, you yeah. The chimes of time bring out the news Another day is through Someone slipped and fell Was that someone you? You may have longed for added strength Your courage to renew Do not be disheartened For I have news for you It is no secret What God can He's done for others He'll do for you no night for in his light you'll never walk alone always feel at home wherever you may roam there is no power can conquer you while God is on your side. Take him at his promise. Don't run away and hide. It is no He's done for others He'll do for you
I mean, I would listen, you know, being a, a tribute artist, so doing Elvis, uh, I would sing along at home and stuff like that. But really only got into it uh, here in Germany when, uh, when we put on the show here, uh, Elvis Das Musical. Bernhard Kurtz, our producer, was so fortunate to talk to uh, Ed Enoch of the Stamps Quartet. And this was Elvis Presley's original uh, gospel group that he sang with uh, in the 70s. Yeah, they, they, uh, he, he organized for them to come over. And so, of course, one thing led to another. We're doing our show. And the next thing we knew was, hey, look, we, we have to do this gospel music. It was such a hit. We'd do two songs in the show, and we'd get standing ovations for these two songs. And so we said, we have to do more of this. I mean, it really hits home for a lot of people. So, yeah, so I really just started it in Germany. Probably, maybe we started singing. I think I met the Stamps Quartet in 2006. I met Ed in 2006. Yeah, and then eventually we put a show together. And so here we are doing our show, our gospel show, and I'm loving every minute of it, yeah. So this next lead, this Graham sing would uh, become Elvis, one of his three Grammys. He became your three Grammys for gospel, and kein einzigen Grammy for rock and roll, also with Jailhouse Rock, Heartbreak Hotel, and so on. The riesen Erfolge befand die Jury damals für nicht gut genug. Die Botschaft des nächsten Liedes ist, ist das Leben, das du lebst, voll Trauer und Verzweiflung? Bedrückt dich die Zukunft mit Sorgen und Angst? Bist du es leid und neidisch und bist fast am Ende deines Weges? Jesus wird dir helfen, du musst nur mit ihm reden, heute. Er ist immer da, er hört jedes Gebet treu und wahr. Geht an deiner Seite, seine Liebe überwältigt uns jeden Tag. Wenn du entmutigt bist, erinnere dich, was zu tun ist. Streck die Hand aus zu Jesus, er streckt dir seine Hand zu. As you bear it all alone Does the road you travel Harbor dangers yet unknown Are you growing weary In the struggle of it all Jesus will help you When on his name you call is always there hearing every prayer faithful and true walking by our side in his love will hide all the day through when you get discouraged just remember what to do reach out to jesus He's reaching out to you Is the life you're living Filled with sorrow and despair Does the future crush you With its worry and its scare Are you tired and friendless Have you almost lost your way Jesus will help you Just call on Him today He's always there Hearing every prayer Faithful and true Walking by our side In His love will hide All the day through When you get discouraged Just remember
But you may run on for a long time Run on for a long time Run on for a long time But let me tell you, get a mic that's gonna cut you down Go tell that long tongue liar Go tell that midnight rider Tell the gambler, rambler I back by and tell God I'm just gonna cut them down Stop God the mighty Let me tell you the news My head's been wet With the midnight dew Bending down On my bended knee Talking to the man From Galilee oh My God spoke And he spoke so sweet I thought I heard A shovel of angels' feet He put one hand Upon my head Great God the mighty Let me tell you What he said Go tell that Long tongue liar Go tell that Midnight rider Tell the gambler The rambler a backbiter tell God Mike's gonna cut him down You may throw your rock and hide your hand Working in the dark as your fellow man as Sure as God made the day and night What you do in the dark will be brought to the light You may run and hide, slip and slide Trying to take the motor from your neighbor's eye Brother, let me tell you, sure as you're born You'd better leave that a woman alone You may run on for a long time now. Run on for a long time Run on for a long time But let me tell you, God, I'm not just gonna cut you down Go tell that long tongue liar Go tell that a midnight rider Tell the gambler, rambler A backbiter, tell God, I'm not just gonna cut him down Some people go to church just to sit in the fire Trying to make a date with the neighbor's wife But brother, let me tell you, sure as you're born You'd better leave that a woman alone Because one of these days, mark my word You think that brother is gonna work You'll sneak up and knock on the door That's all, brother, you'll knock no more You may run on for a long time now Run on for a long time Run on for a long time But let me tell you, God, I might as well cut you down Go tell that long tongue liar Go tell that midnight rider Tell the gambler, rambler, a backbiter Tell them, God, I might as well cut them down Ja, bevor wir eine kurze Pause machen von circa zehn Minuten, singen wir noch ein Lied, das viele als Soft Rock bezeichnet haben. Allerdings hatte das Lied einen biblischen Hintergrund und so hat Elvis aus diesem Lied ein Gospellied gemacht. Geschrieben hat dieses Lied Paul Simon, der später sagte, als er fertig war mit der Komposition und mit dem Text, er weiß eigentlich gar nicht, wie das Ganze entstanden ist, woher die Inspiration kam. Plötzlich hat er das alles zu Papier gebracht. Und der Text ist, wenn du erschöpft bist und dich klein fühlst, wenn deine Augen voller Tränen sind, werde ich sie alle trocknen. Ich bin an deiner Seite, wenn die Zeiten rau werden und Freunde einfach nicht zu finden sind. Ich werde dir eine Brücke über unruhiges Wasser sein, wenn du mir vertraust. When you're 
on the street When evening comes So hard I will comfort you The Stamps Quartet, ladies and gentlemen. And this fantastic band up here, ladies and gentlemen. Please. Crying in the chapel But tears I shed were tears of joy I know the meaning of contentment Now I'm happy with the Lord Well, you may run on for a long time Run on for a long time Go tell that long tongue lie. Go tell that midnight ride. Tell the gambler rambling. That fighter tell the young man's gonna put him down. Stop down on the mind and let me tell you the news. Oh, my head's been wet with the midnight dew. Coming down on my bended knee. Talking to the man from Galilee. Oh, my God spoke and he spoke so sweet. I thought I heard a shuffle of angels' feet. He put one hand upon my head. Thank God, let me tell you the news. Oh, oh, oh. 
to thee how great thou art Sweet cherry stop, let me rock. Oh, swing that cherry stop, let me ride. Rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord. Come and easy, I got the whole of the summer. Don't you swing that sweet cherry stop, let me rock. Oh, swing that cherry stop, let me ride. Rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord. Come and easy, I got a whole moment. So what brought you to the stamps? What happened there? How did you end up with the stamps? Well, I started working uh, at a TV station in Nashville. I, I started singing a little, little trio. And then we joined a man by the name of Jay Kess. And now Jay Cass used to sing with the Statesman Quartet, and that was one of Elvis's favorite singers with Jake, Jake Cass. And Jake had a TV show, I mean, he wanted us to join his group. So Jake had a group, and I traveled with Jake for about a year and a half, okay? And that kind of got me into what I call the gospel music, what I call Sing. the big part. And then I did an early morning show with a guy called Eddie Hill, and he had a show, and sometime I would play bass and sing, and... Uh, it was it, it was it was a nice time in my life because everything was pleasant. It, no, nothing got heavy. And, great. and so then yeah. with Jake, we were doing a concert and J.D. Sumner at that time had the Stamps Quartet. He was at that concert when we sang and boy, he came immediately to me and uh, wanted to hire me to sing baritone. And I knew once I did that, been committed, those guys traveled three and four weeks at a time and sometimes a month at a time and went home. Yeah. So J.D. kept talking to me, and that's kind of the way I, I really got into the business. So I joined them in 1969, and uh, it was very pleasant. and had a good time, and, and we recorded Sweet, Sweet Spirit in 1970. And, uh, you know, that's, our, that's a song I've been singing, you know, ever since, that, yeah. ever since then. Uh, you, so you, you, you worked uh, with Elvis then from 71 to 77, right? Yeah, to he passed. So, did, I mean... It, did you ever get tired of it going on stage every night? Did that ever? No. You know, or was was it always exciting? Is always. Well, it was always exciting, but see, El Elvis made it that way. You know, Elvis made yeah. he made it exciting that you're on stage with Elvis Presley, the greatest singer that ever lived on the face of the earth, the greatest showman you ever see. You, your eyes will never see that. Your ears will never hear that, and 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 not to uh, make you feel bad or anything. You, 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 you're the closest thing to that that I'll ever oh. hear with, with my ears. I mean, and, and, and that's why I miss being with you guys so much because I know uh, how special it is, you know? We all miss you, Ed, here. Every, we miss you, uh, you and the fellas here. I mean, really. Mm -hmm. I mean, so I just want to say thanks so much, Ed. Thank you for chatting with me, taking a, these couple of hours, and uh, oh. I love you so much. You know, do you have a message for anybody over here in Germany or for Europe in general? I just want to say to them that I, that I love the audience and I appreciate them for showing their love to to you and to uh, the show, to Bernhard and to the theater and and to allow on the Stamps Quartet to be some part uh, of their life and letting us share what... I spent so many days with Elvis doing, and uh, I never thought I'd have the opportunity to do it again. And for uh, Germany and Europe to be a part of our life and us spreading and spreading the gospel. I mean, I'm so blessed, and I want to say thank you to all of you. And on behalf of all the guys that let me work with them on stage, the quartet, the Stamps Quartet, I want to say thank you. Thank you, Graham, for the opportunity to be with you and to Bernhard, my dear friend. I do love you, and I thank you for this opportunity. 
and I pray God's blessings on upon all of you. Thank you so much, Ed Enoch, for that interview. It was so good to talk to you. And now, ladies and gentlemen, back to the show. <laughs> There's a lighthouse on a hillside that overlooks life's sea. And when I'm tossed about, it seems out of light that I might clearly see. And the light that shines in darkness now will safely lead a soul and if it wasn't for that old lighthouse my ship would be no more now everybody that lives around me says tear that light house down will you see those big ships they don't sail this way anymore there's no use in it standing round then my mind goes back to that stormy Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Joe Combs on lead. I don't know just what I'd do if the Lord wasn't walking by my side. Well, I was drifting, oh, I was drifting on the sea of despair. I was wondering, I was wondering in this whole world of care. Jesus found me, Jesus found me in the sinful life. He heard me praying, he heard me praying on my knees at night. And now I'm singing, and now I'm singing a brand new song. Because I'm happy, because I'm happy as I go along. I don't know, I don't know just what I'd do if the Lord wasn't walking by my side. What would I do? What would I do? With my what would I do? What would I do when it's my time to die? Well, I'd be lonely, discouraged, burdened on the way. If the Lord was 
cars and walking by my side every day I'd be so friendly I'd be friendless all alone in blue I'd be helpless I'd be helpless with no what to do But I don't know I don't know just what I'd do If the Lord wasn't walking by my side What would I do? What would I do when the tears fill my eyes? What would I do when it's my time to die? I'd be lonely, discouraged, burdened on the way If the Lord wasn't walking by my side every day be so friendly, I'd be friendless all alone in blue. I'd be helpless, I'd be helpless, wouldn't know what to do. Well, I don't know, I don't know just what I'd do if the Lord wasn't walking by my side every day. If the Lord, if the Lord He wasn't walking by my side. To be on stage with these guys, oh, let me tell you. So, look. I'm a, I'm, an, I'm an Elvis fan, and to sing, to, to have heard this all my life, to have heard this group singing with Elvis, and the, the, their tones, and their, the strength in their voices, and to hear all of these things, and then to be singing with these guys. I mean, talk about knocking your, your head back. You're just blown away. Uh, and then you, you know, it's, it just it completes you. As, as an Elvis performer, you're trying to sound a little bit like Elvis, and when these voices come around you, it's the complete package. It, there's, there's no other feeling in the world like it. So to sing with Ed and the boys, is, uh, is a, it's a dream come true. It really is. It's literally a dream come true. Thank you so much. You're a beautiful audience. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Lead me, oh Lord, won't you lead me? I'm tired and I need thy strength and power To guide me over my darkest hour Lord, just open my eyes that I may see Lead me, oh Lord, won't you lead me? Lead me, guide me along the way. For if you lead me, I can stray. Lord, just open my eyes that I I'm lost if you take your hand from me I am blind without thy light to see Lord, just always let me thy servant be Lead me, O oh Lord, won't you lead me Along the way For if you lead me I cannot stray Lord, just open my eyes That I may see Lead me, O oh Lord Won't you lead me With my head bowed low In the darkness as black as could be And my heart 
felt alone and I cried oh Lord don't hide your face from me hold my hand all the way every hour every day To call my own But I don't know a thing In this whole wide world That's worse than being Hold my hand all the way I mean, ooh, I mean, I get goosebumps just thinking about it, you know? <laughs> you feel the room. There's something about this music. I mean, it's very precious to people. And uh, the sincerity, like I say, that the, the lyrics are very sincere. And uh, yeah, and when you got that quartet singing, and uh, I think everybody gets goose, goosebumps, you know? And uh, it's, it's, like I say, it's, it just hits home for them, for their spirituality and uh, everything else. Ja, kommen wir jetzt vielleicht zu den stärksten und aussagekräftigsten Gospel-Liedern, also die most favorite these lieder die Elvis am liebsten gesungen hat. Und da gibt es ein Lied, Crying in the Chapel, hat der Archie Glenn geschrieben, nach einer sehr schwierigen Operation, als er sich näher bei Gott fühlte und ihm dann beim Besuch des Gottesdienstes die Tränen kamen. Glenn hat nur ein einziges Lied geschrieben in seiner Karriere oder eigentlich war er gar kein Songwriter und das Ganze hat sich zufällig so ergeben. Und der Text geht, du sahst mich weinen in der Kapelle, die Tränen, die ich vergoss, waren Tränen der Freude. Ich kenne die Bedeutung der Zufriedenheit. Jetzt bin ich glücklich durch den Herrn. Es ist eine einfache und simple Kapelle, wohin demütige Menschen gehen, um zu beten. Ich bitte den Herrn um mehr Kraft, während ich lebe von Tag zu Tag. Crying in the Chapel.
chapel The tears I shed were tears of joy I know the meaning of contentment Now I'm happy with the Lord Just a plain and simple child Where humble people go to pray I pray the Lord that I'll grow stronger As I live from day to day I've searched, I've searched and I've searched, I've searched But I couldn't find no way on earth to gain peace of mind Now I'm happy in the chapel Where people are of one accord Yes, we gather in the chapel just to sing and praise the Lord You search and you'll search But you'll never find No way on earth to gain peace of mind Take your troubles to the chapel Get down on your and pray Then your burdens will be light And you'll surely find the When I'm doing the musical, it's more of a show piece. You know, there's more, there's costumes and things. It's more about a story where uh, the gospel, I actually feel more comfortable. I mean, it's just, it's really just us performing as a group. I, there's no need for, uh, if you will, like costumes and lighting and things, because it, it's, it's not about that. It's, a, it's about the feeling of the music. So in this sense, uh, yeah, it's just very, very organic, very natural, you know. He Touched Me war das letzte Album, das Elvis aufgenommen hat, aber es war immer noch nicht sein Lieblingslied. Sein persönliches, wichtigstes Lied für ihn war How Great the World. Es handelt sich dabei um eine christliche Hymne, die ein schwedischer Dichter geschrieben hat, Ende des 19. Jahrhunderts. Und dann wurde es 1907 übersetzt in das Deutsche. Damals hat man das nur in der Kirche gesungen. Du großer Gott, wenn ich die Welt betrachte. Und der gesamte Liedtext ist eine Zusammenfassung des Evangeliums. O Herr, mein Gott, wenn ich in ehrfürchtigem Staunen betrachte, was du mit deinen Händen erschaffen hast, sehe ich die Sterne, höre ich das Donnerkrollen, deine Macht sich widerspiegeln im Universum. Wenn Christus kommen wird mit rauschendem Beifall und mich nach Hause holt, welch Freude wird mein Herz erfüllen, dann werde ich mich in demütiger Bewunderung verbeugen und verkünden. Mein Gott, wie großartig bist du. How great the art. God, when I in awesome wonder consider all the big worlds thy hands have made, I see the stars, I hear the road. Thunder, thy power throughout 
the universe displayed when Christ shall come with shout of acclamation to take me home what joy shall fill my heart then I shall bow in humble adoration and there proclaim This next song, my dear friend Michael Means, our wonderful bass singer from the Stamps Quartet, he gets to sing this every night, but tonight I get to sing it. So I'd like to dedicate it to Michael. Oh, well, I'm tired and so weary But I must go along Till the Lord comes and calls Calls me away Oh, yes Well, the morning so bright and the land is a light And the night, the night is as black as the sea Oh yes, there will be peace in the valley for me someday there will be peace in the valley for me Oh Lord, I pray There'll be no sadness, no sorrow, no trouble, trouble I see There will be peace in the valley for me Well, the bear will be gentle And the wolves will be tame And the lion shall lay down By the lamb, oh yes And the beast from the wild Shall be led by a child And I'll be changed Changed from this creature That I am Oh yes There will be peace 
Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for being here with us this evening. I'd like to say a very special thank you to our wonderful band, and of course, the Stamps Quartet and Mr. Ed Enoch. And a very special thank you to our producer, Mr. Bernhard Kurtz. Thank you so much for watching. We love you, and we hope to see you live on stage very soon. God bless you. Hi, guys. <laughs> Beautiful. Come on, sing with me. Why don't you swing down sweet chairs up and let me ride? Oh, swing down chairs up and let me ride. Well, rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord. Call me easy. I've got a whole morning on the side. Why don't you swing down sweet chairs up and let me ride? Oh, swing down chairs up and let me ride. Rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord. Come and easy, I've got a whole morning of the side. Why don't you swing that swing, 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 well, 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 well. Ezekiel was down in the middle of a field He saw an angel working on a chariot wheel Wasn't so particular about the chariot wheel Just wanted to see how the chariot feel Why well, don't you swing down, sweet chariot stop Let me ride Oh, swing down, chariot stop Let me ride Rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord Home and easy I've got a whole morning Ezekiel went down and got on board Chariot went up up and went on down the road Zeke was so particular about the bump of the road Just wanted to lay down his heavy load Why don't you swing down the sweet chair and stop and let me ride Yeah, swing down the chair and stop and let me ride Well, rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord Home and easy, I've got a whole morning well, I've got a father in the promised land Ain't gonna stop until I shake his hand Rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord Call it easy I've got a whole morning of the side Why don't you swing down the sweet cherry Stop and let me ride Yeah, swing Well, rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord Come and easy I've got a whole morning Side. Why don't you swing down, sweet cherry, stop and let me ride Yeah, swing down, cherry, stop and let me ride Oh, well, rock me, Lord, rock me, Lord, come and eat me Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful, thank you. To dream the impossible dream, to fight the unbeatable foe, to bear with unbearable sorrow, to run. Where the brave dare not go To right the unright of a wrong To be better far than you are 
to try when your arms are too weary to reach the unreachable star. For the right For that question or pause To be willing to march into Ladies and gentlemen, wherever you are watching this show, I hope you can feel this spirituality and I hope that you are with your loved ones. And I'd like to do this next song for all of you. Listen easy. You can hear God calling Walking barefoot by a stream Come on to me Your hair softly falling On my face as in a dream And the time will be our time and the grass won't pay no mind saying nothing lying where the sun is baking down upon our sides my lips touch you 
With their soft wet kisses Your hands gentle in reply And the time will be our time And the grass won't be no mine Child, touch my soul with your cries And the music will know what we found I hear a hundred goodbyes But today I hear only one sound The moment we're living is now Now, 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 now Young birds flying And the soft wind blowing Cools the sweat inside my palms I close my eyes Feel the flowers growing As you lay sleeping in my arms And the time will be our time And the grass won't pay no mind No, the grass won't pay no mind 